Look, right, I said I was gonna leave it alone, right? Oh, shit. I said I was gonna leave it alone. I can't leave it alone. Fuck it, I can't leave it alone. Look, motherfucking, um, once again, so BG responded to, back to, uh, BG responded to gangsta. By not responding to him. Pretty much he like a rat. What what when do a rat have opinion, right? Listen, man. To be honest, like I said, I, you know, I'm pretty much I, I kicking a dead horse now. But I, I I'ma say what I gotta say and I'm done with this, right? You ain't gonna hear no more real maybe. I don't know. But listen, cause I like these, I like this. You know, I grew up with Elf, Elf Cash Money listening to him. Like I say, BG stayed in Detroit, you know what I'm saying? Um but this is what I'm going to say. D Listen, nigga. You got to feel real fucked up. Like, BG has... I mean, not BG, but gangster. You got to feel fucked up. There's, it got to be a hurting feeling. Dog, I, and I don't... And I just don't understand why they really playing you like that. Like, if you only told on the dead, and if that's true, like... I, I don't see the big deal on that. I don't. I don't have a... Nigga, listen. If I go to jail and they tell me, I can tell on some dead motherfuckers that I know. And much as I love my cousins, I love my homeboys, I love my fucking grandmama, my uncle. <laughs> listen, my grandmama had eight pills under a mattress when she, you know what I'm saying? My auntie, bitch, if I can get out of prison, you think they don't want me to, you, you, nigga, if I'm dead, you think I give a fuck about what you tell on me? I'm gone, nigga. What, they gonna come to the next life and give me a fucking a, a warrant, bitch? Tell on me, nigga. Listen, you only got one. fuck with these niggas talking about. These niggas out here is retarded. And the thing is, don't nobody live by that shit. But these streets, so-called street niggas. See, these hoe-ass niggas will get a real nigga killed. Because, listen, because, oh, he a, he a rat. He told on dead people. You telling, you telling. Shut your bitch hoe ass up. Shut the fuck up, bitch. You go to jail right now. You would tell on 80 living niggas. You would tell on your own goddamn mama, brother and sister to get the fuck out. Nigga, stop running your hoe ass mouth. The niggas who talk that tough shit is the dick suckers that ain't never been in no trouble. The first, these niggas talking all that shit gonna be the first niggas to fold. Flat the fuck up. I tell out on any dead motherfucker I know. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, you got one life to live out here. You think I'm about to sit in the fucking prison for 20, 30 years, life, and I can tell them, saw some fucking murders, nigga? Bitch, it's told. It's a year. So you know not that, bitch. If you already know, you die, bitch, and you you fuck with me, you getting, and they gonna tell me to get out this motherfucker? I'm, you told them. Hey, nigga, what the fuck? Nigga, first of all, niggas don't give a fuck about telling on a nigga that's here. Niggas tell on niggas that they don't know. Nigga, that's why that's why you don't let niggas know your business. Because your business all out in the fucking street. It be a motherfucker that never seen you, don't know you, but know of you. And they get in front of that interrogation room. Oh, yeah, that nigga blew over there. We heard them niggas moving bricks and this, this, and this. I'm telling you. That's all it take. And they gonna let this nigga go, oh yeah, well who do you know they can get to him, but then next thing you know he working, you caught up. First thing that nigga say, he out of jail, he done ratted on me, but I never knew this nigga nothing. But guess what? The first thing he say, I don't know that nigga, them niggas not my, like the niggas on DEA, rat motherfuckers I know from my hood that I grew up with, nigga. They sit there and say, well, I ain't gonna give you none of my people, but, I, but I'm gonna give you these niggas over here. I, can't, I ain't gonna get it. Nigga, you a rat. You telling. You telling. You tell. The fucked up part about these niggas rat. I know I'm getting off subject, but the fucked up part about these niggas who be ratting, the real rats, they don't even try to fight the case. It ain't like, nigga, you done got to jail. You don't even know if they had a legal warrant. You don't know what they got on you. You ain't even get, you, they ain't even put you in fucking handcuffs yet, and you telling. Like, nigga, you ain't even got from one location to the precinct yet, and you telling. These niggas ain't cut, then they most of these niggas ain't cut for that shit, no way, my nigga. But the niggas who stand solid is usually the niggas who will surprise you. Usually the niggas who you would think that a tail that'll break be the niggas that don't break. The hardest nigga you think that's, that's gonna stand up be the first nigga to break on your ass. This the truth. So I'm getting back to the to this nigga. Gangster. So I don't know why they mad at him. They got some type of hate towards gangster. They do, because if you love them, nigga, that's your brother, nigga. If he only, whatever happened, nigga, it's, okay, that's still your fucking brother, nigga. He's still, you can't take away, you can't erase history. What did he say? So this is what I'm saying, though. It's just like, it's like, he was a nuisance. He was like one of them niggas that they, 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 
okay, he put in work and everything. He went to jail. They was like, okay, cool. But when he was out there, I can tell he was like one of them niggas, a pesty nigga. Like one of them niggas that they really didn't trust and didn't want around, but he was good for doing dirt. That's how they plan him. Like, no, nah, we don't even want this nigga around, man. Fuck this nigga. Like, you know, and then gangster come out here and he talk all this gangster shit that he did. And he thinking like that's like niggas don't give a fuck about that shit no more. You see, you thought you was a killer. You come home, everybody's gonna respect your name. Uh, no matter what, I'm still a killer, nigga. That's bum activity though. That's what I'm trying to tell you is that shit is bum activity. You going around killing nigga? That man, niggas don't give a fuck about that no more. All these young know, niggas is killers. Who the fuck ain't been killed the nigga? So that shit is back in the day, yeah, like you say, to have a few niggas putting in work, you know, everybody, you know, we, but nowadays, man, these young motherfuckers, the hoes niggas is out here with fully automatics and will kill you, nigga. But, but cry when they get caught. So this the thing, nigga, you go do all this motherfucking work. Like I said, you help build cash money, basically. Basically, you, you help, you weren't rapping, but you was, you know, you felt as though you was a part of that shit. You put, he put the work in and all this shit. You felt as though when you got out of prison, okay, you knew you, they weren't going to accept you full fledged. But you ain't think that they was going to be just dissing you. That, you know how bad they got to hurt this nigga heart? That's, that's eating this nigga up. That's going to make this nigga crash back out. He going to snatch these niggas pockets off. I'm telling you this right now. He going to snatch all these niggas pockets off. He going to fuck around. And, 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 listen, gangster gonna fuck around and crash out, my nigga. He talking about it too much, and he giving the whole play for play. You talking too much on it, and you think the feds? If I pick up on the shit, you talking about something? Well, my phone be pinging. I learned this, so I'm gonna leave my phone here, catch a bus here. You know, you talking stupid shit. Like, suppose somebody actually go do some shit. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, you got to think, man. Nowadays, bro, you can't play with these people like that. Like, you talking dumb shit. You, you damn near, you, you, you dry snitching. You snitching. But listen, nigga, you, nigga, you going to sit there and say, yeah, well, you know, I, 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 I can, I can hold this tape for baby. And, you know, it's by him texting me. Hey, that's a threat. You, you know, but you telling the police. So basically, you telling the police. Why you, why you telling us this shit? You know the police listening, so you know they, they hear exactly what you saying. So you dry snitching like a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? You call the niggas rats. But I know you got to be hurt. These BG them making funny. Like who gives a fuck about what a rat say? Like goddamn dog, they just and it's getting worse and worse. So how the fuck do you, you out here? cheerleading for these niggas you got cash money jackets on you got baby old watch holding on to it you telling these old ass cash money stories and these niggas like fuck you like you know so you got to be like damn you you know for you to think that you this big badass killer giggity who don't play no games they playing with your name though they like fuck you and your name nigga they like nigga get your bum ass on that's how they playing you and, but I know that got to eat you up on the inside. That got to eat him up on the inside. And to me, that is kind of unfair, my nigga. God damn, dog. If the, that's still y'all man, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, God damn. I don't know, man. You know, you you know, you know you supposed to be this big, tough nigga. This, this, and this. But they, that's, how, that's, why they, that's why they don't fuck with Turk, though. Exactly the same reason. They playing Turk and this nigga just alike because both of them niggas talk too much that's what happened to turk he got on there talking all this shit putting everybody business out there he got to talking too much you know what i'm saying and that's the same thing this nigga doing he telling all these stories and shit and these niggas looking like damn dog don't everything need to be don't everything need to be brought to attention my nigga you you la you laughing about this shit they like man we don't want to relive this shit we do with that why is you bringing this shit back up and then they get to looking like, if you telling all this, w w what else are you liable to tell? So I'm pretty sure they got their ducks in a row already. I'm pretty sure like, well, he he know this. So we're going to have to cover these tracks. So if he come, we got to we gotta find out a way. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, man, it just it's just a bad look, my nigga. It's a bad, it's a real bad look. Like I say, this little beef shit going to get you a lot of views. But after it's done, my nigga. You know, this thing, man. nigga like Baby can shut you down, my nigga. Like, real talk, he can shut all that shit down, man. 
Off a few words, he can shut this you down, my nigga. So it's crazy that it be beefing with your own brother like that, man. I mean, that don't make no fucking sense. Brother against brother, dog. And niggas used to be... These little niggas used to look up to you. Now they disrespecting you, man. I feel you in a way. But like I say, man, I don't know. Like I say, I, I feel two ways about it. You know, you made the rules and broke them. I just think you should have just got out, did positive shit, and, and just not really fuck with them niggas. Don't bring them niggas' name up. Just let them niggas come to you. They, 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 they grasp me. They see you change. But no, nah, now, now is, you know, now you reaching, you saying BG snitching and all this shit. When you looking at the paperwork yourself, that's why you ain't want to post it. Because you know that boy ain't snitch, my nigga. How the fuck you going to have a statement on me talking about some or a nigga, period. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's like a motherfucker coming saying, well, you, we got paper on you that said that you was going to tell. Like, damn, is my signature under that, nigga? Or did them people say that? And you know them people play a dirty game. Because they'll put some shit in there just because you didn't cooperate. And like I said on the last one, how in the fuck did BG get 12 and a half years if the nigga, if, the, if his homeboy took the case? The paperwork say that the nigga behind him took the case, said it was all his. So if that's the case, then how the fuck did he get 12 and a half years? What is he doing 12 and a half years? So y'all telling me he convicted, two people were convicted for the same gun? I don't, I'm not understanding that. It don't make no sense, my nigga. So you know shit. He might can get paid off that shit or something. I don't know, man. I you know, I know he glad to be home. He ain't thinking about that type of shit really, but that nigga is crazy. And then whack 100 is just I don't even got I ain't gonna fuck that nigga. I ain't gonna mention that nigga no more. He just horrible though. He's, somebody gonna fuck him up. These are facts. Somebody gonna fuck whack 100 up. He talked too much, man. I mean that's that shit that you really on the streets, my nigga, that's, that's, you in violation, but that's, that's, see, that's why I say BG a real nigga, he ain't answering to that shit, he don't even, he don't even respond to that shit, that's how a real nigga play it, man, I don't, I'm not, I don't got time to entertain this bullshit that you talking about, nigga, you know what I'm saying, I ain't gotta explain myself to no nigga, and if Birdman go back to fucking with this nigga, whack 100, man, fuck it, fuck Birdman, you know what I'm saying, like, how you gonna, how you gonna go back, how you gonna, this nigga already talking shit about your brother. You told him to leave him alone. He's talking shit about your brother. That's still your brother. Then, this nigga like your son, he putting this shit out. Dick handling that shit. Well, he don't want to sign with cash money. Why? He got he a grown ass man. He signed to who the fuck he wanted. Which, how is that? This, nigga, how the fuck is that disrespect? Because he don't want to sign with cash money records. Cash money records fucked him over before. Nigga, what he going to get fucked twice? He a street nigga. He okay. He let the shit go. Him and baby ain't beefing. Let that be that. Like nigga, you still should help him just cause he choose not to give him a better deal. Then, like I want to see my options out here, my nigga. I don't want to sign with this shit again and get put on the shelf. You holding some old grudge or nigga, you not pushing me like you supposed to, or nigga, I don't, I want to get paid. I'm not gonna let you fuck me again. Now I'm looking stupid to the whole world. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of shit behind that shit, my nigga. But. Like I said, the only reason I speak on it because it's content. It's just shit to talk about, you know. And I, like I said, I really like Gangsta at first. I, I still, I still kind of feel bad for him, but I just don't like that move that he did about BG, my nigga. That's something you just, you know, you just don't do, my dog. That just you reaching for the sky, my nigga. And then, but that's not even the paperwork that you showing and the shit you talking about is not even what I was talking about at first. What you was talking, about, I want to hear. I, you said that he told on Mooney or. Uh, or Telly Hankton or one of them niggas. You said he was telling on one of them real gangsters. And he and them niggas said that he wasn't living right. So I want to hear from them niggas. That's what I want to hear. You, you motherfuckers be killing me. Not you know, motherfuckers swear they got the tapes and all this whack 100. He, he that's a tape having nigga right there. He a swear. Like I watched the nigga podcast earlier. That's how fake these niggas is out here. I watched a whole nigga podcast today talking about I got footage of Puffy with, in a sexual relationship with Jay-Z. So, you know, usually I never click that shit. I was just bored this morning. Like, let me see what the fuck this nigga talking about. And this nigga literally had uh, P Puffy had came out and hit Jay-Z on the ass. You know what I'm saying? Like, once or twice. You know what I'm saying? That's home. I mean, I, don't, I didn't see nothing. You know what I'm saying? You know, Puffy, a, a zesty motherfucker. That's what he do. Niggas ain't. That, that, that wasn't nothing gay about that shit. That just, 
you know, the two motherfuckers playing. I didn't take it as like, like they fucking like, man, what the fuck wrong with these niggas? Nigga, that's why I, you, you see, I don't have no, uh, what you call that shit? Thumbnails. I don't thumbnail shit my face on that motherfucker. This big head and blue eyes on this motherfucker. That's what you see when, you know what I'm saying? But no, man, that's all I wanted to talk about. That's all I wanted to say, man. You know, I just, I, I, I just was like, damn, man, gangsta really got to feel fucked up, my nigga. You know, you come home, you thinking you, you know, and then, you know, your name's supposed to be this. But I say that's bum activity anyway. That ain't no shit to be glamorizing you a stepper and all that shit. Like, nowadays, that don't mean shit, my nigga. Nowadays, shit. That don't mean nothing no more. That's that's bum shit, my nigga. So you you coming home like you done came from college and you this killer. A nigga supposed to respect your name and they like, fuck you and them niggas you killed, nigga. You know what I'm saying? That, that's how they planned it. So shit. Like I say, man, you better just stay on the road you on with that positive shit. Don't let them niggas throw you off your square and just stop talking about this shit. Let it die down. Don't, don't fuck it, man. You know, these few views you're going to get really ain't going to be worth it, my nigga. Do your own thing. Build your own shit, nigga. Start you a record company, nigga. You know, that's how I feel about it. But um, anyway, fuck it. I'm out of here. Trap Talk Blue. Merry Christmas.